I was always convinced that linguistics and language resources need to be part of digital humanities. And this is a way to, uh, to put that into place, actually. Uh, you can see that with the participants. Uh, now, we have got different types of participants. Some come uh, with a very linguistic uh, orientation. They just want to know about corpora or something like that. Yeah, uh, And the others, they come because they just want to do literature or something like that. Yeah, But in the framework of the summer university, uh, they all come together. And uh, all the skills and methods and uh, tools they uh, learn about in the workshops uh, are then being so-called integrated in the bigger framework of the digital humanities by lectures which are overarching lectures which talk more about methodology or history of the digital humanities and things like that and also project presentations because the school, the summer university is really about digital humanities. In the end that is a big hope and it works uh, well every time to break down these borders, borders between um, for example, linguistics and literature or linguistics and cultural studies. Yeah. There are, strangely enough, um, very counterproductive borders and they're very difficult to break. Yeah. But, um, for example, a digital edition is not just a digital edition. A digital edition can be a corpus and then I need other tools and I can create a resource which is a digital edition, which is a corpus, which can be analyzed, uh, and things like that. Yeah? So I think we need this integration, and um, I think working together in the framework of the summer university is really pushing uh, this integration into the right direction. It's not just about tools, skills and methods. It's also very much about community uh, and um, being inter or better transdisciplinary and uh, exchanging and also being confronted with uh, new ideas. One thing I can say, um, I, I know about the summer university is that people really stay in contact and people come from countries or places where they many times are completely alone. They want to do digital humanities, but there is not a community. And uh, they come to Leipzig and afterwards they have a community. And uh, so this community uh, aspect, I think, is very, very, very important above all in our uh, new way of doing things, of collaboration and digital humanities.